A local union is demanding action from leaders at the University of Louisville. WDRB Stefan Johnson explains the pandemic concerns and demands from United Campus Workers of Kentucky. The newly formed union is made up of U of L students, faculty and staff. And among other things, they want the option to teach, work or attend class here in person on campus or online. I stand with the United Campus Workers as they call on President Gonzalez. These are members of United Campus Workers. To take COVID-19 and the Omicron variant seriously. Thursday afternoon, the union held a rally to share their pandemic concerns with the campus community and the public. So last week, we had a petition going around for Cardinal Health and Safety because we felt like the administration was not heeding our concerns. The union, which is made up of UofL students, faculty and staff, says they've already taken their concerns and a petition to interim president Lori Gonzalez. And after they ignored our petition, we had a phone in for three days where we called the office office of the president. The list of demands includes an option for remote teaching and working, hazard pay for frontline staff, and N95 mask for the entire campus community. You've got five minutes to help us understand um, what you're here for. After the rally, union members took their concerns to the Board of Trustees meeting. We've all received one clear message from the university. Risk your health or risk your career. Thank you. Stay safe. Um, and appreciate your coming forward and sharing with us. It is my sincere hope that somebody in there heard what we were saying. Despite having the floor for five minutes, union members aren't confident the message was heard. It really seemed like there were people that were not ready to listen, but maybe there were some folks in there that heard us. We're offered free masks, the KN95 masks, I believe, that you could pick up in spots on campus. Board Chair Mary Nixon says with the exception of hazard pay, the other concerns have been addressed. We've got a process for students that need exceptions. And so I feel like that the 80, 90 percent of what they're asking for is already being done. To read the petition or see those demands again, just head to our website and look for this story. At the University of Louisville, I'm Stefan Johnson, WDRB News.